Welcome back. Apparently we still have something to do with this guy. Um Ahead, skip. You so it looks like end of the land. Send you down there, and then we'll hit next turn. Unless I think we have enough money to buy this uranium tile here. So darn. How how long is it gonna take? Why are you going that way? You should be going this way, unless this city is Go to the uranium. <laughs> okay, so yeah, last time this asshole declared war on us. Guy who we've been allies with basically the entire game decided, hey, I want to declare war on you. Jerk. And in the middle of that, looks like they ran away. They're probably right here. Or they're down here somewhere. But Germany sent a settler over this way, running through my territory. And honestly, I'm pretty sure that's why he decided to uh, declare war. Was so that he could get his stupid settler through my land. Instead of, you know, asking for military access. City provides plus one appeal to any tiles it owns. Uh, sure. i not sure. We have an appeal map, map mode somewhere. Appeal. Is it going to show us? appeal um there we go all right yeah a lot of this stuff is all torn up so makes sense i mean we're not really going tourism so i'm not that concerned about it um I guess it's really he only has one I'm a little surprised that this guy of all people wouldn't have a few charges just use them there I guess all right um how, how... I'd hit him Those will kill. Nice. More error score, which is... Okay. Next turn, you can definitely move. Alright. Um... This is gonna be a little tough. Yeah, I don't even... We can't even reach Cologne. But we could go and start knocking on his capital a little. Which might be good. We have a balloon being built anywhere. I feel like that is a question. That should be... Have access to the balloons? We do. Definitely want a few balloons, or at least a balloon. So that we can actually take some of these cities without putting our artillery in harm's way. I think we need to be careful because I'm not sure where Germany is tech-wise, but he might have access to U-boats at this point. And as we know from history, U-boats are not good. <laughs> They're not exactly good to be fighting. Alright. I think I will go ahead and move my ironclad over here as well. Oh, it can be built. 
Okay. Uh, do that, do that. This hills. That's just regular grassland. Alright. Um. I don't really want to move this artillery too close to German lines just yet. Put you in the capital in case somebody comes by trying to attack. Yeah, I know. Like, I think I said this in the last episode, but I'm really not worried about Germany, you know, actually hurting us. I'm more worried of... I'm not really worried about Germany, like, hurting us that much. They're pretty... I think this is pretty much just a war to get their settler over here and be annoying. Alright. Um, okay. Next turn. Our cities are pretty well defended, so I'm not... I don't know why you would bother doing that. You're just going to die anyways. Need of, of course. Okay. Yeah, great. Alright. Can we get the kill with this guy? Nice. Another kill. Okay, so yeah, this tornado's kind of on that spot, so it's kind of pointless to just rebuild it. Go ahead and get me it. Buenos Aires, how far away are you? So, this might be a death sentence for Hattusa, having them as a as, as our city state. You might honestly want to take Amani out. Yeah, I think that's actually a good move. Because we're going to want to... Oh, that's not our Amani, apparently. Um, we want this Amani to go to not Geneva. Wong Tom or something. Also would be kind of nice to get rid of that. But we'll we'll worry about that later. We need to start hurting Mexico City's influence or Germany's influence on Mexico City. Alright. Um Buenos Aires, that's Cardiff. Down here? Yeah. Uh, sure. Just put it... I'm not really that worried about Buenos Aires. Okay. Um, go ahead and upgrade to a battleship. Very nice. That. Okay. Do not have vision over Aachen. But we can we can do this sort of gamey move and move our ironclad into a position that can hurt so we have vision on Aachen. And just move it back to make sure that we don't get hit. Alright. Um, artillery. Yeah. I'd rather not engage Germany's ground, uh, by ground until we have our balloon. Because the balloon gives your artillery units an extra attack range. So, that's why I'm kind of inclined to say, let's wait. Can you start 
repairing those walls. You can. Let's go ahead and get those walls repaired. Um. <laughs> yeah, I I don't really. I told you he was. There's something here that he really wanted, and that's why he went there. But now he's just going to lose it to loyalty in five turns, so I'm not even going to worry about it. Stay on alert. You stay on alert. Um. Cod. Eight turns, and you'll no longer be a free city. No. <sighs> Silly Maori. You really think I'm going to give you money? Okay. Well, thankfully, we just got those walls back up. Start hurting them a little. Ooh, city. Actually, I might produce another balloon there. Um, we do have the Venetian arsenal, so it might be worth to get a few more battleships. Hey, hey buddy. Um, okay, so embarked units, um, when you attack them with a boat, like a melee boat, the melee boat doesn't get hurt by them. If it was another ship, then yes, it would get hurt. Uh, let's see, what's... I'll head him down there. This guy, just fortify. That tank's not going to be able to do much against our city. Is he building an encampment, probably? Campus. Okay. Shot there. Now, this guy's not going to be able to do much against these tank armies, but and it'll give this encampment a little more strength and just altogether weaken them a little more. Okay, this city has really bad production, um, but it might be worth just. But go ahead and get your sewer. Okay. Looks like that guy ran into the city, which is unfortunate. But as long as we're right here, we are fine. Okay. I don't remember what this passive bonus is. Plus five combat strength and then movement to industrial and modern era naval. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Go. That doesn't really have. You have a good chance of doing that, so go ahead and do that. Okay. All right, all right. Good cod. Ooh. Hoping that fifteen turns. Oh, did this? Okay. We're gonna have to put the battleship on hold. Yeah, that that's why it went down. Or 
the number of turns to take it over went up. So, I don't know if there are any... <laughs> what? That, that is unique, to say the least. Thankfully, I think they're wasting time, like, dealing with this. And then next turn, we'll be able to fight these tanks, this city as well. All right, Germany, you're starting to regret your decision to declare war on me and break our alliance. Go to sleep. Don't really need you guys. I don't know if there's any ships down this way or if Germany even has a navy. Like they're trying to get around. So. so. We will keep it. Great, more error score. Definitely what I wanted. I'm not going to attack with the Courser because otherwise just going to lose him next turn. Jeez. These times are something else. Go ahead and get your monument. Thankfully this pass is a total meat grinder for Germany. Um, the city, we got, you build quickly, could actually help us. Nothing, absolutely nothing. Alright, um, go ahead and get your lighthouse. Maybe Germany doesn't have a navy? I'm going to go down that way, just so I'm not in range of that encampment. Not that losing that scout thing is going to really make a difference. But it's not really worth it. Yeah, this is really slow going. Uh, but it's really the only thing we can do with our boats. And it might make Germany feel like they should, you know, peace out. How many, how many muskets do we have? Any muskets? We're just going and buying a musket? Not own muskets. Okay. Uh, ooh. Send you there and see if we can't shave one more turn off of Big Ben. <laughs> smart Germany. Very smart. Alright, die. <laughs> Uzi really. Interesting. Almost a canal now. <laughs> okay. Uh, for whatever you reason, you are right there. worth I don't even know how they get around so easily I think I'm pretty sure these type of units are allowed to ignore zone of control which is really annoying I really wanted to like screw them 
if they ever try and attack me again, is put a an encampment like right here or someplace. Alright, shoot him. Kill him. Damn. Playing a little greedy, but I was hoping, I was really hoping that we could actually get him. Okay. This trade route might get plundered. Hoping it doesn't. But. Oh well. Alright. To Aachen. No, this isn't doing much, but it's the only thing we can do with our ships. And it might help convince Germany to just peace out. Great. Keep tearing up all of my stuff. Jerk. Okay, do that. I don't know where that... I'm guessing that one tank ran away. Oh. It's stupid. How long we got until peace? 25? Okay, available in 6. So I was 25 and I got like kind of scared that I was going to have to sit in this stupid war for, for 25 turns. Alright. Since there's nothing down there that we can do, as well keep hitting this guy. Yeah, it'd be really nice to get everything upgraded. Unfortunately, we're not making that much money. Uh, one, two, three. Our Nice to know, yeah, yeah, we wouldn't do anything with that tank, so not worth it. Germany, you put that city in the middle of three of my other cities. Why would you think that you weren't going to have loyalty issues? Ooh, it's like they are at war. I don't know if my allies got called into a war. I don't remember if that's just a military alliance or if all alliances uh, will respond to a defensive call. Okay. This guy's. Looks like he's going to go. The biggest problem with this is the fact that he's tearing up all of my stuff, which is probably one of the primary reasons for doing this. Sewer. Um. This place could actually... No, I don't want to waste the... Mm. Nice if there was something pretty quick. I'm not sure, like, what causes things to be less expensive. Yeah, like, why, why is the total cost or that much compared to this? That's something I never really understood. This city... Um, the city can just go ahead and build its sewer. Ooh. 
Oh yes, Big Ben gives us another economic policy, that's right. So now we need to decide what we want to throw in there. Uh, we have industrial zone adjacency and we have money and some faith from our trade routes. So let's go ahead. I'll I'll go ahead and throw civil prestige in there for now. We'll probably change that. Hopefully that'll help with some of the amenity issues. All right. <sighs> Please kill him. Are you aren't you actually kidding me? Can't bombard with it. Damn it! Are you kidding? That, that's just dumb. And I get up there with this guy. That would completely kill him. Are you really kidding me? Well, come on. That actually makes me very upset. I think I can finish him off that way. <laughs> One hit point, of course. How it always works. Just keep hitting knocking, I guess. Alright, and with that, I'll see you guys next time.